Hi friends, welcome back to Top Tip. Today we are going to see how to update Yamaha Avantage RX A880 amplifier. Please watch the steps carefully and do yourself. First in your computer, open the Yamaha site, I will put it in the description. Open one of your browser and go to the website. Here you can find the product and give the model number. Just do search, then you will get the downloading file, click the downloading file. Yes, agree and do up, up download. Once it download, go to the folder where you downloaded and do extract. Just right click and do extract. Once it extracted, you will get the folder. Once you open the folder, you will get the file. Now we need to prepare our USB. Take one of your USB that will support FAT file system. Connect the USB to the device, laptop or desktop. Right click on the drive and click format. Make the, make the file system as FAT. We need FAT file system. The other same, just press start. It will erase all the USB so take care. Once it done, open it and just copy the file with which one we extracted. Just the put file, just add the paste the file directly. The no any folders it's required. Just paste directly. Now remove the USB. Don't forget to do a safe remove. Now we can go back to our uh, amplifier. Before we do, let's check the current version. What is it? For that, we connected the TV. Go to the menu, amplifier menu. Go to system. In system, go to information. Here you can see the Framework version is 1.8. We are going to update it. So let's close the TV and go back to the amplifier. Here, all you, here you can see the steps in the site. Read the step carefully before you do. Once you're okay with the steps, <coughs> go back to the amplifier. Do a complete power off for the amplifier and connect the USB. After connect the USB, press and hold the straight button and press the power button. Once you see this advanced step, you can leave the button. Now select the pro select program and go to update USB. By pressing the program, you can uh, get the update, uh, get the selection. Once you selected update, you can press info to start the update. It will select USB update and start the procedure. The, it's a long procedure. Uh, I'm just doing a fast forward here. So be patient and wait for finishing the procedures. Once it finished, it will verify everything. In each step, it will verify and do update. Once it done, it will show you successful, update successful. 
as uh, same like this it's verifying again now update is successful now you need to do power off for the amplifier so let's power, so press the power button and do power off okay we do power off then just remove the USB let's again go to the setup uh, setup to verify it for that again press the straight button and uh, press the power button while holding the straight button then go to update information you can go to info again version press info then you can see now 2.07 the new version is 2.07 let's see this again in the TV as uh, same before we see again I do power off and on go to our monitor same before go to system good information then you can see the framework version is upgraded to 2.07 hope you enjoy this video and it's helpful thanks for watching and please do like share and subscribe